what do you think about Floyd Mayweather versus Logan Paul? How do you see this whole thing playing out? I mean, I saw the recent rules. I think it's stupid, their rules, <laughs> but I guess it's they're kind of doing what Mike Tyson, uh, Roy Jones Jr. did. Um, mm -hmm. But I see Logan, no, hmm. no, I see... I mean, I want to support the YouTuber side, obviously, mm -hmm. because Logan's a YouTuber, but I just don't see Logan winning. I see Floyd just taking him out. Yeah. Because, uh, yeah, that's that's my prediction. I think Floyd's going to take knock him out, yeah. Your former opponent, Jake Paul, recently uh, announced that he's going to be fighting Tyron Woodley. Um, he's, you know, got things going on with Showtime. How do you see that matchup playing out? So from from the grapevine what i heard is that jake paul wants a rematch clause he's the one who like put that forward so just mm -hmm. that alone tells me he's afraid so mm -hmm. i do believe that tyron tyron will uh will beat jake how, how do you see that one ending probably third round you'll just clip him and and drop jake that's mm -hmm. what i think yeah do you think that that there's last question for me that there's the possibility that that out of all the different social media people that are taking parts in the fight that there's one that maybe can go and, and really cement maybe a respectable uh, career as a boxer? I mean, Jake is already doing some things, but, you know, he's fought like a Nate Robinson and Ben Askren, which again, Ben was a really real fighter, but maybe not in the best shape when he fought. Um, do you see that that there is that potential for a crossover and kind of really doing something larger in the sport i mean anything is possible really mm -hmm. i mean we've seen that i i never thought logan would fight floyd mayweather <laughs> but that's what i mean any anything is possible literally anything is possible so